and Then There Were None is a murder mystery. And thematically speaking, I believe it does teach the audience a lot. Um, because these ten, 12 people are on an island, and someone's killing someone. And so no one knows who exactly to trust. And I think that's something that's interesting, because you kind of learn a bit about human nature. I really do hope to take away from this just people skills, learn how to get along with people, learn how to manage people, and make sure everything gets done when it's supposed to be done. I used to be kind of shy. Um, now I'm not afraid to speak in public, which is good, because you know you have to give presentations all the time. Um, but I believe it'll help me in my future, because I want to do community theater. This is my first year doing set design, so I was excited uh, to hear that I was doing set design this year. Just like deciding where things go, uh, you know, changing, you know, the paint on walls, uh, just all that kind of stuff, all the small stuff, you know, small details that, you know, people see just on stage with fireplaces, plants, chairs, everything. So, you know, I take everything, I try to take everything into consideration of, you know, does this look good with the lighting? You know, can people still see this from where they're sitting? It'll be my first play I've ever done, and it's a small role, so it's a bit more easier on me to do. I love how extra she is and how mean she is. I think that's really fun to play. She's this old spinster. She She's really, like, kind of mean. She's really crazy about God and the Bible, and she follows, like, every rule in the Bible. She'll, like, yell at you for any, like, little thing that you do.